do you have any um maybe any regrets or suggestions about going to like a uh, osteopathic program like would you have gone into um take another year to go into like an md program or would you have um uh choosing differently based on your experience now or do you feel like this was like a solid experience and you bet you uh, you uh, value kind of the experience that you had and you wouldn't change a thing well maybe somewhere in the middle like i think it has been a solid experience overall and you know i'm pretty happy with how match worked out and um you know the career trajectory that i think i'm headed on i think do school provided you know the necessary um resources to get me there uh, I'd say one thing is, you know, I think a lot of students do fall in the trap of like only wanting to go to an MD school and they keep like pushing back their application like year after year and keep getting turned down and like are really chasing like that rabbit. And I think if that's the main reason, just the distinction, I wouldn't recommend it. I think DO schools are, you know, right on par with MDs as far as like being able to get you into most specialties, maybe like some of the more competitive and research requiring ones, uh, like neurosurgery or ortho, like obviously I think you'd have a hard chance as an MD, but I think one interesting thing is now that step one is pass, no pass and step two might follow suit. I think it'll be, I'm curious to see what the main factors that uh, residencies like will use to pick people to interview now, because I would predict that the focus is going to shift onto research. And if that's the case, then I think MD students would have an like an advantage unless DO school started like shifting gears and like making the research departments much stronger. So I think, I think I've been pretty happy with my decision, but I think moving forward, I'm not sure how like step one changing and maybe step two changing will affect how competitive DO applicants are. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like that? Do, uh, do you feel like DO schools are have a little bit less of a rigorous uh, research focus than MD schools? I think so. Most, most might have a research department and like, you know, have PhDs working on things, but it doesn't seem nearly as robust as far as like from what I've heard from like our MD counterparts and most MD schools, just because um, it seems like MD institutions are kind of tied to much larger like research organizations, you know, whereas I think uh, like a lot of the work that like our research department does, it seems like not as, I guess, like not as robust. So I think that is one thing that holds them back as far as research goes. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's more uh, maybe focused on like clinical practice as opposed to things like research or other um, more, um, more, I guess, research focused as some students might kind of want their career to go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But um, I guess if you hadn't gone uh, to your school, you wouldn't have met your wife, right? Your fiance. That's true. <laughs> so, yeah. You know, no regrets there, right? Nope. <laughs>